Hi, this is Gloria Coppola from Massage Pro CE, live at the American Massage Conference. And today I'm filling in for Ryan, the massage nerd, doing live interviews. And today we have Gabrielle Lindsley from Massage Today. And we're going to find out about this publication and what it can do for you, the massage therapist. So welcome. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Well, Massage Today is a monthly publication published by MPA Media. MPA Media is the parent company. We are an alternative health and wellness publishing company. We've been in business for 28 years. Our core publication is a chiropractic publication called Dynamic Chiropractic, which was started by our president and publisher's grandfather. So this is a third generation holistic company. Wow. Right? And so under that umbrella, we've got Massage Today and Acupuncture Today. So Massage Today, along with our other publications, is written for and by people and experts and the best educators within each practice, right? So Massage Today, we've partnered up with the AMC folks to be here at the American Massage Conference. We've worked with these folks in the past at the Canadian Massage Conference. And great... you're one of the sponsors, too, of this and conference. That's right. So we're very happy to be a part of this um, this huge success. What's going on here today? Oh, it's been amazing. Phenomenal yes. work, right? And we are the international media sponsor. We can say international because it's two countries, Canada and the U.S. Uh, and we have come together with these guys um, to take a very synergistic approach, right? We're taking all the various elements within the profession, bringing it all together to create this wonderful conference, which is very much what we do in the pages yeah. of our publication, right? Therapists can turn to Massage Today to get information on policy, regulations, different kinds of treatments, product information, mm. plethora, uh, uh, cornucopia, if you will, of, of topics. We have the print publication that comes out every month. It's a free publication. Massage therapists can go onto our website or give us a call, either way, to, to subscribe. Again, it's a free publication. Uh, and then we also have our electronic product, which is massagetoday.com, uh, in which all of the content that you see in the publication is online, but there will be additional things, enhanced articles, additional comments. Well, and even the Massage Nerd has his blog on there with that's YouTube right. videos that I've helped contribute to as well. Yes, that's yeah. right, that's right. And we've got, um, we've got blogs, we've got all kinds of things on the website that you may not necessarily see within the print pages. Uh, also, you can sign up for electronic newsletters, which is oh, nice. really big. Because a lot of us don't have time simply to pick up mm -hmm. a publication. And then there's the whole green concept, right? We don't want to contribute to the to the, to the greenhouse effect by chopping down trees. Although we are very tactile, right? They yep. are tactile. They want to hold, <laughs> want to hold that paper. <laughs> they want to hold that paper. But for those of you that don't, please visit the website. Uh, sign up for our newsletters. Uh, they're delivered twice a month. And they're full of all kinds of information. And really, um, maybe even more importantly, we want to hear from you. We want to hear from massage therapists about what you want to see because that's how we know. Our writers are very in tune and very responsive to what's going on in the environment. But if we don't know what's going on, we don't know and we can't Yeah, tell it. us what you want to know. <laughs> yes, yes. Visit the website. There's a contact us link. And please send us comments, feedback, criticisms. I mean, criticisms are just as important yeah. as, as positive feedback. We need to know what you want and what you want us to cover. Also, if you're interested in being a contributor to the publication, right, because we're always looking for writers that um, can write well, yeah. can write about relevant mm -hmm. content, um, and, and fall within our guidelines. And the guidelines for editorial submission are also on the website. And, and pretty much in a nutshell, the guidelines um, really speak to being objective, yeah. right? You can't come in and, and write all about your product. Right. It's not, it's not a promotional thing. Exactly. It's not an ad for your product. It has to be objective. It has to talk about a treatment, a modality, a condition, and ways to address that. Now, I've written for your publication both in print and online. And a couple months ago, we did the one on education in the massage industry, and we interviewed all the different people out there that wanted to contribute. Yes. And we've been getting positive feedback on that. Yes. And even the, the contributing people that I interviewed were glad to hear that their colleagues are like on the same page, yes. pretty much. So that was a powerful article. Yes, yep. education is very, very yeah. important. Yeah. Licensing is also very, very important. Yeah. You know, we 
We estimate in the United States that there are roughly 200,000 massage therapists, but we can't really verify that number because every state has different licensing requirements. Right Where I live in California, it's a voluntary thing. So, it, you know, nationally we have to get on the, on the page with that. Um, we see a lot of growth in the market. We see that... It's, be it's becoming um, less and less of an alternative treatment mm -hmm. and more mainstream. It's becoming very integrated mm -hmm. with other kinds of practices. Medicine, medical yeah. doctors are using it. Chiropractic. One of the largest employers of massage therapists in the United States happen to be chiropractors, yeah. which is great. It's where I started. Is it? 25 years ago. Awesome. Yeah. Oh, yeah. that's great. Yeah. And then we also see um, possibility for growth and opportunity for growth in Canada, right? Because nice. the Canadians... There it's 20 to 40,000 mm -hmm. massage therapists. We estimate, but we don't really know. So maybe someday soon you'll see a Massage Today Canada. Oh, well, I have to tell you something. I help the massage nerd in the background with his fan page on Facebook. I'm the massage nerdette back there. And one of the questions I posted out there was, what is your favorite publication, written publication, for resources and articles? And everybody said, Massage Today. Oh. Well, of course, wonderful. they said Ryan's website, but right. written, they said Massage a Today. A printed word, Massage printed, Today. Yep. Well, that's a big compliment. Thank yeah. you for posting that question. Yeah. That's, that's very nice. Yeah. That was good. Great. So anything else you want to share with the readers out there? Keep picking us up. Keep reading us. Thank you very much for your support. Without you, we're not here. We don't exist. Give us your feedback. Don't be shy. Tell us what we're doing wrong. Tell us what we're doing right. We like to get compliments, but we also realize that it's not always the way we want it to be. We're always looking for comments. So thank you very much, and keep up the good work. Thank you, Gabrielle. And I want to thank Massage Today for being one of the sponsors for the American Massage Conference. Of course, without them, this wouldn't happen. That's right. Happy to be here. Thank you. And San Diego. Yes. Yeah, San, San Diego, Diego next, next year. year. That's in okay. our backyard. Oh, wow. Yeah. Cool. All right. Thank you so much for being here today. Thank you. Thank you.